I had a cookie that was right here. I had a cookie. It was, did someone take, did you take my cookie? Okay, that's the last one I had. Uh, uh, we're rolling, you didn't tell me we're rolling. When we start rolling, you gotta say action. Action, that means the camera's starting to roll. It's doing it again. The, yeah, it's working, What? what is, what is that? What's up guys? How is everyone today? Well, hold on. Better, better. Now I can see you. Have a different kind of vlog today. Slightly different, hold on. Adjustment. I set this thing up perfect. It sits down perfect. It's uh, it's all perfect and it moves on its own. Different, as I mentioned, different kind of vlog today. Uh, we're gonna get started with a couple of things. First thing I wanna mention is that Wheels and Waves, my car show here in Malibu, is December 16th. It's an important car show. It's an important uh, cars and coffee because we are gonna do everything we can to celebrate the first responders that had to do with the Woolsey, flat, the Woolsey fire. It's still hard to say, it's still hard to say. Just got a call from my friend Paul Grisanti and he has found three new places for people, three different families that were displaced. So things are moving along. It's it's not easy, but people are finding new places to live. Malibu is recovery, it's good. And we wanna celebrate that. We want to get people back on track. So on the 16th, our next Wheels and Waves, we can't throw the last one last month, uh, next Wheels and Waves. Not only is that gonna be cool and we're gonna celebrate the first responders, our celebrity guest is gonna be Patrick Kilpatrick, who I had on the, the show, on the vlog, not too long ago. If you got a chance to see that episode, uh, he is a an actor that uh, plays a lot of bad guys, but he also plays a lot of good guys, but he's an especially fantastic individual. But if you're new to this vlog here, if you have not been hanging out with us for that long, I, I feel that a slight, short explanation is in order. I am a car designer. I've always been a car designer. Went to the Art Center College of Design and uh, got into the film industries, into movies, did about 400 movies as a car designer. You know, Batmobile, uh, movie car type stuff. And then a year or more ago, we started a new company, which is Fireball Publishing. And now I do children's coloring books that are automotive and sea life. But we focus primarily on automotive. That's why the the, um, the Corvette book is coming out. And it's, if you're watching this, holy cow, I think it's out. You can get it on Amazon. It, it might not be available just at the moment that this is out. But shortly, if this, if my, my calculations are correct, sometime today, it'll be available on Amazon. But also, my wife Kathy has been a school sculptor and a builder for many years and she has tremendous clients. She built all the Nintendo characters, all the mascot characters for Nintendo, all the commercials and all that stuff. And we did all those commercials. I'm Super Mario, but don't tell anybody. But she also has Ellen DeGeneres as a client and for the last 15 years she has been building uh, Ellen's Christmas mascot. So if you ever watch the Ellen show around Christmas time, which is happening right now, if you're watching the show right now, you'll be able to see the mascot that, that brings the gifts out and the mascot's name is Comet. It's a reindeer and it has been a reindeer for the last four or five years. Uh, the reindeers have just been changed each time. So the reindeer comes back to us, Kathy modifies it, and then sends it back. But rarely do we get a chance to show you guys what we go through to actually create those things. So today's vlog is gonna be kind of dedicated to that. So without further ado, -do, <laughs> I said do-do, let's do this. Hello. What do you got going on? I got Vixen here. Mm -hmm. Vixen was the mascot for the Ellen Christmas show last year. Which, what, was that 2017? This is when she was very beautiful. But now I have to change her into something else. I'm not going to say what it is. But first step is to take apart all the things that aren't the next character. But it is a reindeer. It's always a reindeer these days. Kathy's going to be working on this new costume. It's going to take about a week or so to uh, to finish. We do know what the character is, what the next reindeer is. We can't say what it is just yet, but we will. And I'll come back out uh, every few hours and we'll be able to show you guys her progress. So it's pretty awesome. Gone. 
think I'm going to hang it in my shop. It's a little small, a little understated. I don't think it goes with my outfit. guys may want to close your eyes because we literally have to uh, remove the reindeer's head. What's the challenge now? Oof, well, I gotta get this metal out. And of course I did a good job of encasing it. going to be the, the structure to hold the head up straight so it doesn't sag forward. And it's pretty complicated. You've got to like make a curve, a curve that goes into the head, and then a curve that goes into the body. How did, we don't even have a tool for that. How did you make those? Oh, I have a tool. Yeah? Let me show you. <laughs> Kathy's been working on the costume, Comet, for Ellen DeGeneres for the past day or so, day and a half. Let's get an update. This is the step. Well, first of all, I had to cut off the existing nose. This is not the nose. It's just going to be part of the muzzle. And this will be the nose. Making a new mouth. And he has kind of like that off smile. Yeah. 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 Is that what it looks like? Show, I don't know. show me again. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> new cheeks. Lightning bolt antlers. Mm -hmm. Which will be double thick and rounded like like antlers are like lightning bolt antlers yeah, with, with a metal piece inside also uh -huh. yeah like real antlers yeah oops those are sad antlers and then i'm trying to figure out the eye this is not the eye but it's going to be a bulbous eye like that kind of but not a, not anything like it eyeballs ooh <laughs> very nice <laughs>
it. Right or wrong, that's the spot. And all of this is happening while the Malibu fires is happening. You know what? The show must go on. It's really quiet outside. It's kind of creepy. Hey, Kathy. I'm pretty sure we're the last ones left in Malibu. Because we have a reindeer to build. <laughs> we have a reindeer to build. Uh, so, uh, as I mentioned earlier, if I didn't mention, there's a big fire that's happening in Malibu, and, and we're not leaving because Kathy's got a reindeer to build. That's right. That's how committed we are. I can't build it in the car. Uh, no, you can't build it All in the car. The hotels are filled in Santa Monica. Right. Uh, there's no hotels available. We've gotten lots of calls and texts and emails from people offering their homes to all different kinds of places that we can we can stay. But it's not that easy. There's a lot of stuff when it comes to building a costume, as you can plainly see. He's working on a little, little thing for Abigail for Christmas. So far, it looks pretty good. Chrysler for sending us this new Pacifica hybrid. Uh, yeah, but how about Bill and DeGeneres sent us all those cookies? Uh, we did get a, a nice bigger. package of cookies and cupcakes and all kinds of stuff as a thank you from the Ellen Show. That was really cool. It's a little bright right now. Uh, I'm in the shade. Kathy isn't, partially. Maybe. Yeah. Uh, but we just got this new car delivered and I'm going to be taking it to a show tomorrow and doing a bunch of stuff. But so far, so good. 
It's a minivan. It's electric. It gets 84 miles per gallon. That's pretty freaking cool. 